best not to draw attention here. So close. Oh. Hey, one more, one more. Okay. Hey. Well, I can try. This way, I'll get two. <laughs> sure. Well. Up. Strong. Ready? Yes. Oh, you made me miss. You. <laughs> Remu, come here. I found a Haini cave. A real one? Yes. Ah, go ahead. You're gonna love it. There's like 16 hyenas, 16? and they're so dark and scary. Well, you know what? Uh, I'd rather go hunt with my papa. You always get too scared. Hey. Hey, hey. Let's go on a real hunt. Huh? All right. <laughs> come, come. What are we hunting? The oracle wants the pelt of an ibex stag for the ceremony. You will stand next to the pharaoh. Won't you buy it? You're the magi. When I'm magi, I'll stand next to the pharaoh. You'll never be magi. You're too scared. That's not true. What about the hyena kid? Shut up. Enough, you two. The sand is so hot on my feet. Sometimes they light on fire. It makes you faster. <laughs> It is up ahead. Can I come? <laughs> hey, your mother's waiting for you. All right. See you at the ceremony, Hamu. Bye, Chenzura. The herd is around here. We don't want just any stag. We want the pack leader. Which one is he? Big, with giant horns. Quiet now. Do what I do. Hey, this is my favorite part. Stay low. They will spot us unless we become like our moon, the god of hiddenness. Yes, Papo. We are the hidden one. Senu! Senu! Come to me! Why are you calling Senu? Chenzero told me I should steal his feathers, so that my wing ceremony gets me to the field of reeds. <laughs> Anubis weighs your heart against a feather. You cannot tamper with this weighing ceremony. It is sacred. Ah! Oh, oh no! I scared them! <laughs> it's okay. In more time for us to spend together. 
Enjoy the journey. Stay with me. We can do it together. See? My eyes and hand are in line with the arrow. That is the only way to shoot true. I wish I could put a hundred arrows on this bow. Shot to the heart, hardly hurts at all. Let us get that belt. <laughs> we will take this to the Oracle before it gets dark. One day, I want to shoot an arrow through the sun. <laughs> you can. Your arrow will have to become Senu. Imagine, all my arrows are Senus. Then I'll be able to hunt anything. You said you'd like to see the Pharaoh up close. Yeah. What if you stand with me by his side? Can I do that? As my son and the future Magi, yes. Kapo, what is a Magi really? The first Magi was a protector of the Pharaoh. But now, it means you must protect all the people of Egypt. Not just protect them, but work for their well-being. Oh, Kapo! I'm so excited to be Magi one day. You know all the secrets of Siwa. What if I never grow up to be a Magi? Ah, of course you will. You are my son. But I get scared. I try to be brave. But sometimes it's hard. Hold on. Let's go this way. When I was about your age, sometimes I got scared too. Your grandfather was a well-known Magi. And he wanted me to bring honor to the family when I succeeded him. Yeah? One day, he took me up this way. At the top, he said something to me. A single word. <laughs> it changed me. One word? I got over my fear. I knew I could do anything I needed to. What did he say? I will tell you once we are there. Jump. Don't think so long. Jump. Yes, Papa. You trust me. You can. I do. I will. Uh, jump then. Come back. You're not ready. I can do it, Papa. I can. Shut up, you filthy little shit! Help! Help me! That's Shanjira! I said shut up! Run home to your mother. Chanjira will be fine. I will take care of it. Magi Bayek! Go! Now! I'm scared! I don't want to go home alone! Oh, then we'll just do what I say! Please! I'm indeed Major here, who summons me. Sheath your weapon and follow me. You said you only wanted to talk to him. <clears throat> Come. Uh. Who are you to give commands to me? You piece of shit. We don't have time to piss away.
Make a sound and you're dead. What took you so long? Didn't want to be seen, sir. Kept to the shadows. We are pleased you have joined us, Medjai. It is of great importance that we gain access to the vault. The temple priests stubbornly refuse to assist us. You are perhaps reluctant out of loyalty I to the they just Oracle. Wanted to ask him we a have question. someone to help convince you otherwise. See that no one comes in. Are you hot? Go ahead. Try it your way. I'll leave my son out of there! Your son has something to explain to you. Would the Ibis show him the orb? We believe we need this to enter the vault. This is a waste of time! The boy is frightened. It's all right. Papa, they need you to tell them about the vault. They need to know how to use this. As measure, you must have some clue to your legend that explains its use. I don't know anything about this vault! Please leave my son out of this! He will be discovered. Quickly! Talk to your son. If the vault isn't open when we return, you'll never see him again. It's all right, son. No? Papa, I can get it to you. What? No! Remo, don't! They're going to hurt us. Remo, they... Remo! This foolish waste of time! Remo! Remo! Don't cut time! Tell us! Oh, I, I, I don't know. We must go now. I will cut the heart from the boy. No, no, wait, 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 wait. He Stop. will never know the afterlife. No, 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 I, I will tell you. I will tell you. Stop. I will tell you. No, 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 no. the time. Stop. 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 This is your man. <laughs> the snake takes that as your answer. <laughs> And save your own son. You are no one. By yet of nothing, father to nobody! <laughs> here! Here! And here is your nobody! <laughs> May the hidden one greet you. The Lord of the Duat awaits.
Well done, my friend. Our hero returns. You brought joy to Siva. Uh, hmm. I should get to Alexandria. I need to see Aya. Don't be in too much of a hurry. Siwa will always need its Magi. But you are the protector here now. I'm always pleased to help. Come see me when you are certain you are ready to go. We will drink beers to our friendship, huh? <laughs> Be sure you are ready before you go. I must leave Siwa. There are others to whom I must deliver justice. Especially the one known as the Snake. How will you find these men? Aya has been tracking them in Alexandria. I must find her. She said she would be visiting her cousin at the Great Library. Great Library? And she said if you are coming to tell you one word. Serapis. Serapis? The god that Greeks and Egyptians share. Of course, I see. And Bike, do something about that beard. <laughs> Goodbye, my friend. Paying attention. Okay, you need to take a break. The animus is rejecting you. Uh, I'm fine. Yes, but your kidneys aren't. Go add more cyclosporin before they shut down. Yes, Nurse Geary. That's medical officer Geary to you. So? How did it go? My mods are holding. Subject's memories are perfectly clear. If this doesn't convince Abstergo to give me a place on the animus project, nothing will. His name is Bayek of Siwa. The death of his son turned him into a killer. Think it'd be of interest, Abstergo? Don't start. You know, they're not gonna be happy with how he handled this assignment. They know I don't work by the book. Well, this time you lit the book on fire and then stomped on it. Anyway, none of this will matter if you're comatose. Now go get that cyclosporin. <sighs> One bar. No, half a bar. Still looking for the cyclosporin? I definitely packed it in the med kit.
So long, and thanks for all the fish, Berkeley. March 21st, 2006. The day Layla Hassan drops out of college. That's right, Professor Moore. I'm not finishing that Jane Eyre paper. I got a job, and I'm headed to Philly next week. This whole classroom thing, it's not for me. Mom and Dad are freaking out, but they'll accept it. I'll be working towards something real, making real money, and I'll be closer to home. Not that I'll visit any more often. Sophia promised there would always be a place for me at Absurgo, as long as I show them what I can do with a circuit board and a pair of pliers. Sure, I'll have to work my way up to a place on her special project, but that doesn't matter. It won't be long before she or her father, Mr. Alan Ricken, notices what I'm capable of and asks for my help on the Animus. I swear, I get more done reading the latest copy of Wired on the toilet than the rest of the guys do all day in the lab. I mean, the body band? Really? If people can't take a walk on their own, they aren't going to listen to a watch that tells them to do it either. This is all so pointless. I should just go back to... Wait. That's probably what the body band would tell me to do. What I should do is build something that will simultaneously blow people's minds and the doors off the Animus Project. Nothing at Abstergo Fitness is going to be big enough for that. I'm bored as hell. But there's nothing like boredom to stimulate creativity. Yep. I think the body band needs a little adjustment to its language processing program. The right decision always feels like home. My stuff's the same. My locker smells the same. It's like I never left, but I did. And I can never unlearn what I know now. How will it change my work at the Historical Research Division? Hard to say. All I know is that it will. Our Dom booked us a lunch. Nothing fancy. She wanted me to meet Deanna Geary, my new medical officer. She looks like she was born in the middle of a cornfield, but she seems okay. I can't believe she left homemade cookies on my desk. I don't know why I told her about getting stood up last weekend. I never talk about personal stuff at work. At least it seems like I can trust her. You need that to stay alive in the field. Too bad most of Abstergo's tactical units don't consider trust a priority. in the official credits, but all those emails, all those middle-of-the-night phone calls from Madrid, there's a lot of me in there. Sophia, if I'd known you just wanted to strip mine my brain and leave me in the dark, I never would have followed you. Go away! There's no candy here! Nothing in life is ever free. Ever. The Animus. I can tell. I know it wouldn't have worked without my advice. Just look how they did the heat sink. The VRMs the high amperage rating by transistor. It was me who told them it would offset failure of the... What's this? Hello there, DNA reader module. Are you ringing my doorbell? Maybe there's some candy here after all. I've come to the conclusion that Sophia is shit at hiring staff. The entire Madrid facility. Ugh. How do they not see it? It would be so easy. You just have to parse the genetic memory input and work from smaller data pools. You could even process incomplete samples and still create a reliable model for high levels of synchronization. The reader module and the decryption software would need an update, but it's doable. Madrid's probably congratulating themselves just for getting this far. Meanwhile, I'm partying with some congealed veggie curry three plasma screens, a disassembled animus, and Raw Victoria's debut album on loop. Sahete. Dee will be mad when she sees how I use Milton's DNA, but what did she expect when she asked me for help? I needed someone's genetic profile to test the animus, and, well, his was right there. All in the name of science.
I like morning briefings. They're short, minimal nonsense, and they have free coffee. No downtime this week. They're putting me and Dee on a plane to Alexandria two days from now. I don't get why Hathaway's in such a rush. We're being deployed to extract an artifact. If it were a person of interest, the push would make more sense. A person could be halfway across the world in a couple of hours. But an artifact that's been sitting around for 2,000 years, it's not going anywhere. An artifact of high interest. Heard that before. It always ends up being some crappy pottery shard or half an old book. My animus runs on DNA, not tableware. It'll be strange visiting Egypt for the first time since 2013. Back then I went looking for my roots and found trouble instead. It's good that Dee's coming. She always keeps me from doing anything too stupid. Turns out the artifact of high interest is also a person of interest. A mummy and a golden opportunity. I've informed Dee of some changes I'm making to our assignment parameters. She acted mad, but I know she's eager to see my animus field tested. Abstergo won't mind. Well, they would if they found out, but they won't. <laughs> Hathaway's intel was a disaster. They have no idea what's going on with this extraction. Field tech is fun and all, but that's not why I left Berkeley. If the Animus lets me ride DNA this old, if the reader can model the missing codons and extrapolate the genetic memories that aren't mine, Sophia would lose her... Abstergo. Abstergo will come to me on their hands and knees. My name will be right up there with Ward Vidix. Alameda Kidaminda. Too bad the Madrid facility got blown up. But I bet they'll build a new one soon. This one will be in Philly. And its lead engineer will be Leila Hassan.
Dean never puts in enough snacks. Need that med kit. Come forth by day, and I will guide you home. Who are you talking to? Bayek's mummy. Real chatterbox, that one. Still looking for the cyclosporin? I definitely packed it in the med kit. Generator's holding up. Good job, Layla. Need that med kit. Damn it, my papers went everywhere. Whoops, anything important? Yeah, the notes on the animus. Still looking for the cyclosporin? I definitely packed it in the med kit. The genetic sequencer blueprint. Never got the creases out. for the cyclosporin? I definitely packed it in the med kit. Need that med kit. Still looking for the cyclosporin? I definitely packed it in the med kit. holding up. Good job, Layla. Need that med kit. Got the cyclosporin. Two CC should do it. Don't forget the alcohol wipe. I wish I was there to help. You do a good job looking after me, even from the hotel. And I know how you like your aircon. Going back in. This is so badass. Be careful.
must protect this great land. Alexandria is where the snake thrives, and Aya lives. I must find them both. friend Menehet. He will be in the temple. He always is. Whoa. 